YouTube, it's your boy D. If you guys in the spot to make it too f yeah, I mean, you already know the vibes. I'm looking at Twitter and I see a lot going on with Tyler the Creator. He was just on an interview and he was talking about Ian. I know things look a lot different in the background, but we are currently in my new apartment. Yesterday, right, everybody talking about w. Tyler Creator because he had duty where he called yeah, out just a lot of people. <clears throat> and it wasn't just mainstream or anything like that. He was actually talking about people that were on the come up. And we all know that Tyler oh, yeah, Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, see, I seen this post. K uh, Kirko or whatever the f how the f you say his name. I want to speak his mind. He said he don't think that the underground is doing anything original. Wait, let me see. We all know that. Tyler the Creator says today rappers can't perform, sound the same, and cosplay each other. Now, like, everyone is doing cosplays. The Spider-Man meme of the next guy, everyone's using the same slang. You are from L.A., you saying slime. Who's from L.A. saying slime? I get what he mean, though, but it's like, I think people are just following trends, no? Tyler Creator is going to speak his mind. He said he don't think that the underground is doing anything original. And like I told y'all, he spoke about a lot in that interview. I feel like uh, to a certain extent that's true, but because there are a lot of people who use auto tune and like have the same pitch auto tune. Like there's a lot of people who sound the same. Like arguably sometimes Nico sounds like Sofago, but I can tell the difference. You feel me? Or where how a lot of people think Osama sounds like Ken Carson, but it's like to me he don't sound like Ken Carson. You, you get what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. I don't get that. I don't get that motive though. But shit, I get it though. It's a lot of people do be sounding the same with their uh with their auto tune. Like I, like Young Fazo sounds like a lot of other niggas. I'm not even gonna lie to you, bro. But one of the things that stood out and actually blew up on all social media platforms and so does today was him talking about Sometimes. Ian. All right. Now I don't think he said his name or anything. What do you say about Ian? This white kid, regular Caucasian man, and he's like mocking future in the Gucci main, like rap music. This is like weird. What do you mean mocking? Nah, let me hear him say it, bro. What the f like that? But we're just going to go and the watch this part of this video because I haven't seen it yet. But let's go. Tyler seemingly calls out Ian in his new interview with Math Carter. This white kid, regular Caucasian man, he's mocking future oh, yeah, and see Gucci man like rap music. This is face. like weird. So I'm going to go ahead and play the clip for y'all. This white kid, regular like Caucasian man. And he's like mocking future and Gucci man like how? rap music and like people are like dude hard it's not even like satire it's like i'm just joking i'm just mocking it but i'm like no 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 you can't do and i hold rap music so close Me too. i would just want to say that tyler we all know he bro he take rap really serious you know bro. what i'm saying he probably got a whole different perspective to my but what but but what do you mean he's mocking like you think the nigga is like you think his you think him pursuing his rap career is just like for shits and giggles because he's white or some like, what are you talking about, gang? My heart, because it changed my life and everyone's life around me, and I'm a nerd. Yeah, I, I get what you mean, though. About this. this is, like, weird. It's not weird, bro. And I'm why I'm... But the reason why it's weird is because it's new. That's just my opinion. I feel like it's always going to be weird because it... I No, I think it. he feels like it's weird because, bro... No kind of shit, but Ian might be like, like a prophet, like, bro, because he's like, he, bro, he can't, he, he didn't even come out of nowhere too. Ian been rapping, gang. It's just that some of his songs were were going, like, they were getting views, they were getting plays, like on SoundCloud, but niggas were noticing it. That's the thing. But it's like Ian, like, what, what Tyler the Creator doesn't understand is that he probably doesn't even know that Ian has been rapping for a mad long, bro. He probably was been trying to find his sound, just like every other rapper, bro. Some people find their sound a little bit quicker, maybe like you feel me. From what I, for what I've heard, and when I heard Ian's old music, bro, he kind of always rapped the same, bro. Like he always sounded the same, bro. You feel me? So it's like for him to think it's just like him mocking. It's like gang. He's not. Yo, don't, don't quickly objectify ian as mocking just because he's a white man because i see if you understand if y'all didn't know bro tyler the creator is very pro-black you feel me you know like pro-black like in uh, boondock shit where like oh they see a white man they gonna think oh that nigga's just automatically privileged this that in the third bro i'm not saying ian's not a privileged nigga look at how the nigga be dressing you see you see this even though he was referencing a meme bro nigga ian when he was coming up with his Bro, he was making his music on the floor in his garage, and the garage was not on some pretty shit. 
You feel me? I'm not, you feel me? I'm not grinding on That's just what it is. That's just what we know. You feel me? But I don't think the nigga is mocking anyone. Like, I think he actually takes his music seriously. Like, you say a mock. A nigga can't get inspired. <laughs> like, what if the nigga got inspired? Like, yo, niggas be saying Ian sound like Until Japan. Let's say Ian does know Japan. What if he got inspired by him? What if he got inspired by Future? What if he got inspired by Gucci Mane? I never really, like, I've listened to Gucci Mane, but, like, I don't know why he referenced Gucci Mane. Because he don't sound like Gucci Mane. Or Future. And he don't rap about the same shit. Ian is different because he doesn't rap about the same shit that niggas be rapping about, bro. Listen to his listen to his songs, gang. It's different. It's weird because it's different and, and it's coming from a nigga that's white. You feel me? But don't automatically feel like the nigga's mocking, bro. Or just making fun of it. You feel me? Maybe he respects it, gang. Like, bro. I don't know. It's just new rappers, man. We're in a new generation. That's new generation. Me. Looking at it and something about it, like, I'm sure this nigga don't feels. even sit well with me in comparison to someone like a up. Mac oh, Miller man. or Eminem who it didn't seem like they was mocking it. Mm. They had a genuine love for it. And they but how do you know that Ian doesn't have a genuine love for it, gang? Like, bro, the nigga barely even has done a, a f interview yet dog chill gang y'all like yo we don't even know muddy they were still just being For sure that you know themselves okay all right now i get what he's saying all right so you so so tyler has a feeling that ian's not being himself all right that makes sense maybe it's just inspiration <laughs> exactly story, like, we all know that he's oh a, nigga, a young nigga can't be in spot yo god forbid a nigga get inspired talking about ian there's i get inspired by duke I'm, oh, that was Dick Rod. Oh my God. Oh my God. My fault. I don't even know why I just said his name, bro. I got inspired by Bruce. So do that mean I'm mocking him because uh, I started streaming and to become a variety streamer? No, nigga. Like, what the f There's no one else out there that sounded like Gucci Mane or sounded like Future, okay? There, Ian is the only white kid doing that. So I'm not exactly. surprised. You feel me? Now, a lot of people are going to take this as Tyler hating. And I understand why. You feel me? He's an older guy. We're in a new generation. If you say something against the underground, the underground like to do this thing where they just call you an old head. They say, hey, you just don't understand. And we didn't seen that with tons of different scenarios. Like, I'm Dante. Y'all remember fuck? that, right? Now, do I think Tyler is hating? No, I don't really think he's hating. I think he's just speaking his mind like anybody else would. You feel me? I feel like the new gen of rap, these dudes that you see blowing up right now, it's all vibes to them. It ain't really taken too serious. But I'm looking at these comments. Somebody's what? You don't, think, you don't think Ian's taking his serious? now it's all vibes to them it ain't really taken too serious but i'm looking at these comments somebody said unnecessary ian hate somebody said yadi's bringing him around yeah that's my ian hate game yadi's bringing him around like a trophy how is he bringing him around he just met the nigga bro i'm like a trophy and he from atl laugh out loud nasty what? work that's some dick riding shit. i don't know how ian snuck into rap music what yo yo you know what's crazy like yo honestly like on some real shit, really think about it in ian's point of view all these niggas are saying oh i don't know how ian s snuck into the rap career so the nigga wasn't supposed to prosper off of his music he was just supposed to like stay small forever like what yo Ian were just on Billboard, so it makes sense. It makes sense. Some people feel like Tyler's right. Not gonna lie, he sounds like an old head. I already knew that was coming. I already knew people was gonna start saying that. It probably just rubbed it probably just rubbed Tyler the wrong way, bro, because the nigga is so like he's so like so die hard about rap. Somebody said Ian makes better aux music compared to Tyler though. What can't say that, bro, because there's, there's two different genres of music, bro. What? Somebody said, a little I don't kid, think bro. that serious. Just let people have fun, enjoy what they want to listen to. Exactly. Yeah. Like, bro, let people, like, my nigga, yo, Tyler stating that is like, he's mad that people are listening to this nigga. Like, dude, this is mocking my, my bros, man. It's f***ed up, man. It's not real f rap, man. Like, what the f***? Bro, there's a billion people on this planet, bro. You you gonna be tight because a, a good amount of people want to listen to f Ian. What if he was inspired by black rappers and he has a lot of black fl uh friends? It, that's all it is. Somebody said, "On oh my life, we bumping Ian before Tyler Creator." I ain't gonna lie. I'm bumping Ian before Tyler Creator, but like you for me, like that's not even that's not the that's not the that's not the point, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. No offense to Tyler, bro. This nigga got lie. us watching. Wait, what? What the f is this? Is this JoJo jo JoJo's bizarre adventure in Tekken or some shit? Have been playing Ian more. Somebody said, "How the f is it mocking?" Somebody said, "Yeah, yeah like how's that mocking?" Bro? Ian's music only popular because it sounds like someone else. Someone. It sound. Who does it sound like though? 
Niggas was trying to call him um Yeet's little bro. Nigga don't sound nothing like Yeet. That is crowding, bro. They said the same thing about Dusty Lil Kane, bro. I know, said he ain't wrong though. People do it for the money nowadays. TikTok has really f***ed up how people take music in now. And somebody else said, see, and these niggas are just making educated guesses, and they're just, just they're just wrong and f***ing dumb, bro. Y'all over here making conspiracy theories that Ian is just doing this shit for money. What if the nigga genuinely like like how he likes his sound, and he's very grateful that he's blowing up? The nigga has been rapping for mad long, my nigga. Like you, like bro, I think it's weird, bro. Not gonna lie, we don't care about his opinion. All right. Yeah, I, I, to be honest, I, I don't care about his opinion because it's like it's not gonna make me not listen to Yeet, bro. I mean, it's not gonna make me not listen to Ian, bro. Moment I listened to figure it, figure it, uh, figure it out. I started listening to all his songs, fully support him. I f with his music, bro. His music is in my playlist. Ian team responded. He respond. They actually I don't did know. respond. So we're gonna see that. And his name like Ian Ferguson or some shit. Yo, Felicia to go. I signed Ian. And I'm from Atlanta. He sounds nothing like Gucci or Future. Yeah, that's, that's what I just said. Like, how the f does he sound like Gucci or Future? What are you talking about? But I never thought I'd see the day where you became old and hate on the youth. That ass. Like, yo, you dead hate. Like, yo, what? So let's say, let's say he was, right? Would you not encourage him to use the sound that he has and evolve? You're basically saying, oh, man, this shit's weird. What the f You just saying this shit is weird. You're not encouraging the audience and whoever listens to you that hey man if, if you're inspired by someone you like you supposed to be saying that's good you basically making it seem as if it's weird to be inspired by someone even if if ian was inspired by someone with his flow basically nigga gotta be more pr trained man they don't be thinking it like it's cool you can you can say what the f you want but also you gotta learn how to talk and that's 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 just what i learned I believe Ian's manager, right? He posted on his story. He said, My fault, y'all. I'm not picking my nose. I, I just be touching my nose sometimes to see if there's anything in there. I ain't gonna lie. And then added Tyler. He said, I signed Ian and I'm from Atlanta. He sounds nothing like Gucci or Future. Laugh out loud. It's called influence. But I never thought I was. God forbid a nigga get influenced. Like, what? See the day where you become an old head and hate on a youth. Laugh out loud. And it's kind of crazy because I never thought we'll come to this day where Tyler's being called an old head. I never thought. <laughs> See, I'm going to be real. I understand both sides. You feel me? There's a lot of people besides Tyler who say the same exact thing. They say the same thing as Tyler is saying. And the craziest thing about it, they be younger than him. So the fact that they just call in Tyler an old head just because he has an opinion, you know what I'm saying, on a rapper that's blowing up right now, that you feel me? That's just his opinion, gang. But at the same time, Tyler should be. It's his opinion, but it's a bad take. Tyler is huge. Pause. You feel me? You got an audience. You make it seem as if it's not even like he's influenced by the nigga. Mind you, Tyler don't know Ian from a can in the paint, bro. He don't know him. He's just guessing that nigga's mocking because the nigga's white. The people that are blowing up right now, they all have inspiration, bro. That's just the new gen, bro. Everything is new. It has to come from somewhere. Not everybody can be just straight original. Like some dudes look up to Cardi. Some dudes look up to uzi or that's just how it is bro now do i wish a lot of these rappers were original and had their own sounds yes i do but i'm just here for the vibes i like the music that's out right now i don't see the biggest problem with it i'm glad that Tyler same spoke out his opinion but he is getting a lot of hate for this he's getting a lot of hate because he ain't pr train his words like i just said you basically made it seem like it's it's not good to be influenced like like duty just said nigga not everyone can be original gang you feel me? Not everyone is like lyrically talented with the flow of some crazy like on some laser dim. You feel me? Look, look, Lil Chris. I don't see him as a rapper yet, but it's like you feel me. He's influenced by laser dim. You feel me? What's wrong with that? You, you like I don't know. Like what? Because he's white, he's mocking. No, maybe he's just influenced by the nigga, bro. And now he for me, maybe when he gets older, he'll pick up a different flow of his own. Like there's nothing wrong with that, bro. If I was a rapper, I would have said that. Me personally. Y'all just let me know how y'all feel about this whole scenario because it, it does look bad. Facts, yeah, let does. me know. But like, yeah, bro, like, I ain't gonna lie. That's kind of crazy, though. Coming out of Tyler, the creator, bro. You Tyler, the creator, bro. Like, what the f***? Why would you say that, gang? I'm over here thinking, like, you, 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 you modest. You, that doesn't seem very modest of you, gang. Actually, I never expected that out of you, bro. Tyler, the creator, like, he be saying some wild shit sometimes. Hell no. But it's just, it's suspected though. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this shit, man. Do y'all feel like do y'all feel like uh Ian's a writer or is he just influenced and niggas is just hating because he's white and he's actually nice? Can't front. I like a lot of Ian's songs, bro.
I even like I even like um some of his um, his not unreleased but old music. Let me let me play y'all one. Y'all probably never even heard this, bro. Oh, just like her bag. Shit with my heart. He get act, but he won't get cash. He don't play no part. Your boyfriend warming a bitch. He ain't never gonna start. I don't text back, don't need friends. I just need more dollars. And a trust by throwing out white girl. All of the fans, they begging for me. We did not come right here to fight y'all. We keep things for settling beef. Every time I lose track of the right now, by my tease is better for me. We are knock his motherfucking lights up. Give him wings and set him free. In LA, I went red. Cause we ain't got my name. I made this bitch upset. I know this hoe still loving you. It's getting to my head. I can't stop running from me. I'm sipping muddy red. I got food in my stomach. Thought it was none, got none for free. So you ain't getting none from me. I married a dumb deal for the fee. In the trash bar, pushing the pee. In the floor, so he dropping the G. 100 o'clock TP, he gonna be. Yeah, look. Those who don't have his fear.